Hey everyone, it's Siobhan for 889 and I'm just going to show you a little sequence that you can do to work on strengthening your glutes and building lots of kind of support and stability for that pelvis, that hip area. So come on down to the mat with me. All you need is a mat or a flat surface. Okay, you're going to start right down on your back. You're going to have your knees bent, feet flat, about hip distance width apart. You want to think of having your arms heavy at your sides. Take an inhale. As you exhale, you're going to push into your feet, lift your hips, and you're going to inhale to lower down. So that's a simple, basic shoulder bridge in Pilates. Exhale to lift the hips, and inhale to lower. So what you want to watch here is we're not doing this big rib popping motion. You want to think of keeping the chest really heavy. Your hips should be higher than your rib cage. When you're at the top, you want to imagine your heels pulling towards your bum and your knees stretching towards the front of the room. Okay, so you continue lifting and lowering for as many reps as you would like. Then you can move on to pausing at the top, so hips are lifted, chest is heavy. Can you shift the weight into your left foot? You're going to float your right leg into tabletop without changing anything else in the body. Replace that leg back down to the floor. And again, you're going to exhale, lift that leg to tabletop, inhale, place it right back down to the floor. So when I'm doing this, really important to push into the left foot and your right arm. Those are your anchor points, okay, and that's going to help you keep really steady through the pelvis. Once you've done a series of those, you can come down for a little bit of a breather, okay. Take an inhale, exhale, get ready to go right back up. When you are ready, float your right leg into tabletop, so the same leg you've been working with, foot is flexed, you're going to kick straight out and away, pull it right back in. Straight out and away, pull it right back in. So this is when you're going to start to feel those belly muscles firing as well. The minute we're moving the limbs, we kind of integrate the core and the abdominals a little bit more. Pushing into the upper arms, keeping really strong through that left foot. If you want to add on a burn, pause at the top, little pulses up with the hips and you can do anywhere from five to ten pulses keep it smooth not sharp lower the foot lower the hips and you can give yourself a little bit of a hug at the end of that yep. bring your arms maybe wide legs down and you can kind of sway your head to one side knees to the other good so of course you would re or you would repeat that exercise on the other side. Um, have fun with that. Okay, thanks.